What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? This is Demo Storm, and we're here with Way of the Hunter, coming out August 16th. Thank you, THQ Nordic, for giving me access early to the game. So, what are we going to do today? We're going out hunting. Yep, that's the name of the game. And, uh, yeah, you're, you're basically taking over for where your grandpa left off, over at the Bear Lodge here. You can see it on the map. Bear Den Lo Ranch, sorry. Um map is ginormous i have only traveled up and down this really i haven't even ventured into the other lands um i started to see some elk when i was down south here i did get the campsite so we can fast travel down here if need be which is nice um but i was thinking about hitting one of the objectives today which is to get lesser scup meat and ross goose meat that can be found up here, more towards our swamp area. But I can actually fast travel here. Royal and I traveled up here. And then I'm going to head south from there. I could use my jeep. But we're actually going to avoid that. We can also do some tasks for this gentleman to get permission to hunt here. Impression. Let's just take a look. Was that a... But I saw I got the thing called impression. Oh. Oh. <laughs> we finished it right away. Job. See what left type of place and decorations he placed. Oh my god. Alright, so we're gonna go back to our hunting. That's the name of the game. And you can always check you out the map. discovered Ness Perth Valley Swamp Habitat. Prepare to stick your feet in swamp vegetation and abundant water. This habitat is a home for many waterfowl animals, like diving and dabbling ducks, as well as geese. Many venture here to hunt moose. Their size may lead you to believe that they are an easy animal to locate. Game is but gorgeous. They tend to be good at vanishing between marshes. I will always tell people, YouTube does not do games justice. So, take that with a grain. Uh, so we do need to head around here before we can start hunting. We're not allowed to hunt on his property yet until we do his missions. We can, however, call our jeep in. The jeep. We can actually go back here, go into the storage, and switch out our weapons if need be. Kind of like a mini home base moving. Can't fast travel to it, and it is really loud. I apologize, but audio sliders are still kind of figuring them out. I am playing before any day one patches, guys, so keep that in mind as well of any bugs you may see. Really haven't hit many, if at all. Mostly my own incompetence. Alright, since you are loud, we are actually going to park you up here and start moving on our own. I do have a shotgun with me. And there is fall damage if I take too bad of a fall. We could be in trouble. And we're now on hunting property. So you can put waypoints on your own. Especially when it comes to tracking. Very useful. And you can see these little paths... Or actually animal paths. If we follow these, we should be able to find some type of animal. Or at least a sign of one. Ducks flying around. And it looks like a moose. Oh, we keep our eyes peeled. We may see a moose today. So you can see they make a path right through everything. I have a perk to be able to use my hunter vision while I'm walking, which is nice. And you earn perks just by doing things in game. Not really hunting animals to get them unless you're trying to get certain gun perks. But all different things. Walking around, finding different things. All different ways to get perks which are found here. Like this one I got for selling 15 big game animals without it knowing my scent. I need to fall unconscious. Flexibles. Taxidermying. Photo range. Play for 12 hours. 150 kilometers in my vehicle. And you got some gun perks up here. Hold my breath longer. So. 
Yeah. This one seems like it's going to be fun. Travel seven kilometers in a prone stance. <laughs> Sounds like a good time. Yeah, you can see the little trails. Pretty easy to pick up on. And usually that will lead you to a pretty good hunt. You can see these zones. Looks like duck. Oh, Ross Goose. That's what we're after. Critters show up a little bit better under the uh, hunter sense. Yep, you're just a duck. We're just gonna sell you guys up. Sounds so close to me. I do not know. See, that's very useful. That's what we're looking for is lesser scum. We shot down a few more. There we go. More duck sounds. <laughs> Jesus. We just pelted these things. Alright. We're looking for zones like this. Along with our Ross gooses. So you gotta keep an eye out. We do have our trusty binoculars. Help us see things before we really stumble upon them. We also can go into a more stealthy walk. If we want to be quieter when approaching. That's what we're looking for. Got a twofer. Some nice goose meat. Need six pounds of it. So, real fast, I am going to turn down a little bit. Just add a bit. When you're next to the river, it's just deafening. few more gooses. Peace. Oh. Ducks are making some noise. Looks like I left one out here. Yeah, so I could buy a better shotgun. One that has like six shots or something, but... So the reason we're hunting is actually to... For high-end, like, restaurants and stuff. Wild game meat. That's why we're actually hunting for, and we get the missions from those restaurants, things like that. So. Thought I saw something big. Keep an eye out for our gooses again, or our lesser scup. Maybe a moose. A moose would be nice. 
not seeing many hunting trails being formed over here at this time. I also have seen bears in this area, and bears will attack if need be. If cornered. There is health. You gotta take care of yourself, and not get charged. Two hundred and forty. I don't even know if I want to take a shot like that. There's a moose for you, though. They're on their way. They don't even know we're here. They're calm. The shotgun blast, I guess, didn't scare them off. I tend to keep my hunter vision up quite a bit. And we are hunting some duck. Oh, lesser scup. Let's look into the animal. Uh, we need to analyze static signs of the animal more than learn more. Smaller duck. And goose noises. Gooses. Nice two star right there. I think I picked the right one. Never be too sure. I shot you twice. Oof. Unfortunate. Yeah, I ruined some of the meat. Oh, you were the two star though. Take it. Never can complain about two two stars on a bird. We'll get more into the uh, the bullet cam after. Go after some mule deer, maybe. American black bear. Keep an eye out for our little feathered friends. Up, down, left, right, in the water, above the water, in a tree. I look everywhere. The wind is behind us, so our smell is not too bad. But I'm not seeing what I'm looking for. But we can do a little bit more research on it now that we have found another spot. Yeah, their trophy ratings by their weight. Uh. Okay, feeding time and sleeping. They eat and they sleep. About 12 o'clock they're eating. Back the way we came. Of course they are. Oh, 
they should actually be around here. Keep her eyes open. Gooses. Yeah, a lot of gooses. So Restart dog. I've yet to see any scup. I've only seen ducks and I've seen geese. Slowly move over here. I'm looking for a really small fowl, is really what it is. You're a three star. Yeah, I'm not turning down a three-star bird. Ruined only point zero three of the bird. And I bet it all. So, the other thing about it is me hunting the bigger star things is actually going to ruin my world a little bit. So, they actually added a thing called fitness in, like, the genes. So, you want to actually, for a while, hunt low stars to create higher star ones. Because if you get rid of all the low, you know, the lower star stuff, they can only breed. And that's where male and female ratios come in too. They did include that in the game as well. And I'm curious on how that's going to work out after I hunt all these big game Well, Will my game just get really, like, low, low star things? Or should I be killing off the low stars to build a bunch of high stars? Which sounds like it's how it's meant to be. So at some point, I might just have to come out and just start sh blasting lower level stuff. No more ducks. The hunter vision gives me a lot of information. Keep moving. There's what we're looking for. I'm actually just going to prepare my shotgun because we're going to be blasting. I could do my little predator walk where I stalk in, but... Keep an eye out. If they start flying, we start blasting. What are you? Is that why I can't see you? You guys are all on land. Yeehaw. I didn't hit anything.
Nope. So you were a pretty high trophy, weren't you? A three star. Right, I saw where they landed. Oof. It's a hunt, all right. It's landed around here somewhere. Funny, they, they like uh, I would never in a dream get this close to a deer. Usually, I would already shot. These ducks walk right up to you. Where are we at? I swear you guys were right over here somewhere. I just targeted something. Where? Right on the end. I gotcha. A little bit of a hike, but we'll blast more this time. I was hoping for the bird shot just to spread and kill multiple, but not that lucky. I'm looking for a blunderbuss, and this thing is actually more accurate than that. I see all ya. I could buy a 22 and just pop, but. What's the fun in duck hunting without a shotgun? I could have went for the four, the four shot one too. Not as fun. Nice break now. I do not like shooting things in water. Jeez Louise. They might turn around. We're still short. Come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. Time to find all these bad boys. I shot two down with one shot, but maybe I'm mistaken.
Hmm. There's the other one. Another one on the side of the river. Somewhere out here. Yeah, that wasn't a smart shot taking one over here. gonna find it and the funny thing is there's time on the bodies too so I gotta make sure I find them in quick time or else the meat goes bad what are we looking at here did they come back they did I don't like leaving meat in the ground, but tracking in this game is much harder. We definitely heard one over here. Are you kidding me? Not how you want to hunt birds. Because <laughs> you do crap like that. I destroyed the brain, the flesh. Yeah, that's not the way. Usually you want to hit the wings. We'll head back, see if there's another hunting mission. Might be another order. Yep, we got one. For unexpected tastes. Covers two black scare bears with a fitness score over 50%. That's rough. So we're going to go back to our objectives here. I got some from little things. So this is deer management. Looking for adult deers. The low finesse. There we go. Mule deer. How's our money? 3,000. Not bad. So let's head down and see if we see any mule deer. Sometimes I get lucky and they're right there. Just chilling in the field. We're going to run down the hill and then see what we see. Black bear, though. Oof, that's going to be a hunt. I had a blast one, I think, f three times to take it down with a rifle I have currently. Shot placement is everything. fox wind will be behind me as I walk up and down this river looking for mule yeah we gotta make sure we pick off males of like a lower s s tier they have to be adults or mature not babies or youngins so we'll see always a hunt I do have a collar if need be. Calls females though, not males. We got some pheasants in this area too. I'm 
Yeah, my shot placement is questionable at best. That right there looks strange. We got big paths, two big paths right next to each other. It's usually a good sign. What are we looking at? Yeah, mule deer. So they do move through here. But I just got a whiff of one. Yep. Any mail. He got a mail. He's young though. Yeah, young males. Not really what we're after. We'll take a shot though. It will sniff me out though. What are we looking at? These are hunter scents. We can kind of get a distance. At 182. Give me a broad, please. I do have an upgraded scope so I can aim better. please <sighs> look at that movement though there's the hop and you can see his movements changing he's moving around he's still moving Placement wasn't that great. And he's down. Beautiful. So I do have a marker on him. Just going to show you guys the, the difference in blood as well. Blood has different colors in this game. Red is usually organs. Uh, stomach will be a little bit blue or green. Oh, he caught up. You see that? He's not totally dead. We're going to have a tracking on our hands. I was hoping to find the blood trail for you guys. But there'll be some over here. I thought he was dead. So it is pink with medium amount of bubbles. That means we did lung him. And yeah, we'll slowly follow the blood. He rubs up against things. There he is, he went down. Yep. So, this is our new camera we got here. So we see the bullet went into the lung and it's slowly losing speed as it goes through. We did go through a bone. And it looks like the bullet slowly lost, and it's embedded in his lung. But when you hit a single lung, you usually want to hit both lungs. As you can see, I destroyed one full lung. I boned it. So we're going to lose money because we destroyed some of the flesh, some of the bone. Overview, one star. The weight, 83%, so he was going to be actually decent. We lost a pound of meat. And yeah, we could sell like that. Let's see if we can find another thing to shoot at. Well, not bad. So I wish I knew what the exact impact point was. I'll mark it next time. There'll be a large amount of blood. Usually you can tell a lot by it. Pink lungs with bubbles. It's got air. 
Running is never advised in this game, especially. Birds, on the other hand, don't care. Adult male right there. 200 meters. See if we can get close. Yeah, getting anything out marked off on this mission board here will be excellent. We also saw some mule deer up on this hill, so keep that in mind. doing a stealth walk not really sure the ranges of it yet like how when I sh when I should be doing this walk doesn't hurt to do it quite a bit might have a hill for cover I'm not sure if they can see me or not Not seeing any spooked, so pretty good. Calm, only 164 meters. Or feet, yards. I could switch it back to uh, metric, but I'm just used to what I'm reading on the screen. <laughs> yeah, as you can see, we have plenty of energy to go right through. I want that male to turn, though. Female we could take. But our males are... Oof. We don't want to shoot them in the butt. Pull out the intestines. Ruin the meat. We can hold. The animal animations aren't bad. Tail moving and stuff. There's a mature male up there, too. That's what we want. It's the one that's in that bush. But I have no sight of him. Two star will do. We know you're there. 
That's an adult male. That log. Oof. in the shoulder. Just to confirm his fitness. He's an adult male. Oh, I spooked him. I don't know that shot. trees and everything. Put him in the ground. So we destroyed the lung. It took some time to bleed out. Yeah, the angle was not good. I gotta aim more for this shoulder blade here. More at the neck. So I hit more of the more of the flesh. Or aim a little bit lower. Hit the heart. You were 79%. Yeah, you were the two star. Sad but true. Back in our adventures. I'm not even going to try and hunt down that back of them. They're into the wind and everything. We took one of the, the good males out of their group too, which is unfortunate. Not sure if I actually spooked them or not, because they didn't start running. All of them should start running if I spooked them. That was just... That looked like a head for a second. I'm like a... Antlers. my hunter vision up just so we can hear them run if they spook. Pro 
approach carefully. There's the mail I want. All right, we got two shots off. Full focus mode. Hoping to see some blood somewhere. Ain't seeing any. This one I think we hit good. Mother effort got up. <laughs> Not seeing the blood. He is hurt. bullets. There's not more blood. That lunged him. Alright, the first shot. I missed everything. I hit an artery. So he's going to bleed out anyways. Second one hit the lung. Artery's already gone. Yeah, then we punctured the artery. And the third one went through the lungs. And it just completely went right through and hit the arteries again. So... Well, lost. What was your one star? Thirty-nine percent. So we should count towards our thing. Yep.
which is all we really care about. So we're going to end here. Thank you guys for joining me for today's episode of Way of the Hunter if you want to check it out. August 16th on Steam. Store page in the description. Adios.